I think I've found my purpose in life and my purpose is to be a minister of God to make the world a better place. Without an ounce of doubt, it's been a really sad, harrowing and highly emotional week for Nigerians. But Nollywood actor Yol Edoche has somehow managed to give everyone the comic relief they so desperately need. This comes after the film star casually announced that he has a call from God to be a pastor. Taken to his YouTube channel on November 3, 2022, the father of five, who is currently embroiled in a paternity scandal with the ex-husband of his new wife, revealed that God lifted him to where he is today to use his fame, fortune, status and global reach to preach the gospel in words and actions. Speaking about his convictions, the movie star claimed he had the calling long ago but has always felt that the time wasn't right. According to Yol, it dates back to 2019 when he had an accident and heard strange voices telling him it was over while unconscious. But because his creator has other plans for him, the 40-year-old actor said he was given a second chance at life to become a minister of God. I have a calling to be a minister of God. In the past, fans have witnessed celebrities turn a new leaf to become pastors and like you must have guessed, these celebrities got the support and blessings of their fans. But in the case of Yola Doce, Nollywood fans have accused him of using the name of God to chase clout so he can make money off the cheap publicity. Just a few months ago, amid scandals of betraying May Edoche, his wife of over 17 years, the actor declared for the presidency and begged Nigerians to support him by purchasing the presidential form for him. As you may have imagined, angry Nigerians immediately pounced on the Royal Castle star actor. Unknown to them, he was using the declaration to stay on the radar of brands looking for promotions. By the time social media users figured out the tactic, our dear Yole Doce had already cashed out. Now coming after the movie star declared he has a calling from God, netizens have called him a jester trying to position himself for yet another massive cash out. This begs the question, does Yol Edoche really have a calling or is it just doing it for the hustle culture? And how are fans reacting to this bombshell? Hello guys, it's Tico here for African Glitz. Before 2022, the youngest star of veteran actor Pet Edoche was one of the most respected celebrities in Nigeria. Many admired how the handsome father of five stayed away from scandals and controversies and especially how he was a family man. But this perception of Yole Doce changed overnight on April 27, 2022, after he took to social media to not only introduce the secret son he had with his side chick, Judy Austin, but also to inform fans that his side chick is now his second wife. As you can imagine, Nollywood lovers were highly disappointed by how the actor betrayed his wife, May, who stood by him for over 17 years. Many social media users hurled obscenities, some tried to confront his wife, who found out online, and some attempted to invoke the cancel culture on the film star. In the blink of an eye, the movie producer was milking a situation that was humiliating to his wife and children. Before our eyes, it didn't take long for the actor to start a promo for other brands who wanted to take advantage of the scandalous situation, even if it was to the detriment of his wife's mental health. Without letting the social media space to get over the bombshell he dropped, the film star came back three days after and got the internet space all fired up by declaring presidency. Sharing a campaign poster on April 30, 2022, Yol Edoche asked Nigerians to channel the energy they are using to criticize him for voting for him so he can fix the country. This is not without first asking Nigerians to donate money towards purchasing the presidential form. Yet again, this post sent Nigerians into a frenzy as they attacked the actor for declaring for presidency to fix Nigeria when his home was on the verge of collapse due to his wandering carrot. Hours after, many social media users realized they were played for a fool after they witnessed Yol Edoche shamelessly using the publicity to do as much paid advertising as possible. It was crystal clear that the actor was only concerned about cashing out. Five months after declaring for presidency, the father of five has again got everyone talking after promoting himself to Minister of God. Breaking the news on his YouTube channel on November 3, 2022, the actor revealed that he has a calling from God to preach the gospel through his actions and words. Claiming that God blessed him with fame and money so he could use it to spread the gospel of Christ, Yol Edoche said he has finally found his purpose in life which is to make humanity a better place. I have a calling to be a preacher of God, to be a minister, to preach the word of God through words and actions. I have had this calling a long time ago. Actually, 
many years ago. But I've always felt maybe the time hadn't come, the time wasn't right. But now it's very strong. I feel the time has come. God has blessed me in this life. By God's grace, I've become one of the biggest, most celebrated actors on the continent of Africa. God has taken me to a very high point in my career. I am starting to realize God lifted me as an actor to where I am so that I can become one of his ministers, the actor said. I accept my calling. Yes. Taking us back to how he got the calling, Yol narrated an accident he had back in 2019 that left him unconscious for hours. The 40-year-old said he heard strange voices saying, it's over, and whatever plans, dreams and aspirations he had were going to end at that point. However, a miracle happened and life came back to his body. The movie star said this second chance at life was when he realized his destiny was to be a pastor and powerful soldier of God. Surprisingly, Joel won't be halting his acting career for his new calling. According to the Odogu, it will combine acting and preaching the gospel. Of course, I won't stop doing films. <laughs> I'll always be an actor and at the same time, I'll be using my, my career to preach the word. You know, I don't think I'm leaving. I'm leaving your screen anytime soon. No, <laughs> I'm still going to be acting. But not without saying, God bless you, like a proper Nigerian man of God. Shockingly, many Nigerians are not buying Yole Doche's new calling. According to some people, he's just trying to distract Nigerians from the new scandal enveloping him. It's no secret that for a few weeks now, Judy Austin's ex-husband, Mr. Obasi, has been on social media pressing the neck of the actor for his new wife. In an expose, Mr. Obasi claims the actor and his second wife have refused to let him see his children. That's not all. Judy's ex-husband said he was sleeping with her until Yol Edoche paid a bright price. Hence, there is a possibility that the son the new couple welcomed recently may be his. Reacting, social media users have placed Obasi's picture and that of their son side by side, and some concluded that the young boy looks very much like Obasi and not Yol. With the news becoming more embarrassing by the hour, many speculate that Yol is trying to distract everyone from talking about it. However, a different faction of netizens is convinced that y'all may be broke and trying to trend on social media so as to get paid advertising gigs like earlier this year. But what if it's not for paid advertising gigs? What if y'all Edoche really wants to become a minister of God? Many social media users are convinced that Sakpa has hit the actor hard in the face and he wants to cash out from tight and offering like other prominent pastors in the country. Hence, he's starting his own ministry. Reacting, an Instagram user wrote, Since he married second wife, it be like him head the chic. Another user wrote, Pastor with two wives, who now go be Mama Gio? Also reacting, a user asked, And you wasted it on the laps of a strange woman? Also reacting, a user wrote, He needs to return the wife he stole from another man before he opens his mouth to call on the name of a holy God. A Twitter user wrote, It's another hustle. Acting doesn't pay well. He need to go for the big bag. My own is that nine female members go hear him. If you don't get it, forget about it. Also reacting, a user wrote, Na Mount Zion film Yole Doche go come the act now. No wham, we go see they watch his movie. Also reacting, another user wrote, Since this man married Judy, he is just talking anyhow. As many people continue to drag Yole Doche's recent calling to be a man of God, the actor has decided to knock his haters. In a post on his Instagram page, the actor reminded everyone that while they are busy monitoring and discussing how many women he married, China is set to take over the country. Pastor Yol Edoche has spoken. Tell us guys, what do you think about Yol Edoche's calling to be a pastor? Do you think he is just chasing clout or real? Or would you say the actor wants to actively do ministry work to cash out like other big pastors in the country? Lastly, do you agree with y'all that Nigerians should be discussing the country's situation, not monitoring how many women are married? Share your opinion in the comment section down below. If you found this video informative, please comment, like and share. Also, don't forget to hit the subscribe button to be notified every time I upload a new video so that you don't miss out. Thanks for watching and see you on our next one.